This is what I would do if I was trying to figure out what was going on with my hormones. First thing I would do would be to start tracking my cycle, figure out when I was ovulating during the month. Not when my period app says I was ovulating, but when I'm truly ovulating. Ovulation can tell you so much about what's going on with your hormones. Specifically, it tells you the balance between estrogen and progesterone that you're making throughout the month. For example, let's say you have a 28 day cycle and you're ovulating on day 18. That means that your luteal phase is about 10 days long and follicular phase when you're making estrogen is about 18 days long. That ratio is a little bit off. Ideally, you want your luteal phase, so post ovulation, to be between 11 to 14 days. That means that your body is making a healthy amount of progesterone. Short cycles and short luteal phases can be low progesterone. Your luteal phase is healthy, it's between 12 to 14 days, but you're still getting PMS symptoms, really painful periods, you're really irritable before your cycle starts, you get a lot of cravings, mood swings, bloating, acne, like all of the PMS symptoms, but you have a healthy luteal phase, that's where you might be dealing with some excess estrogen that's throwing off the balance between estrogen and progesterone, or you might not just be eating enough or getting enough nutrients in your diet to support progesterone levels. The first thing I would work on, if this was me, I would start to work on balancing my blood sugar, especially in my luteal phase, because when you're in your luteal phase, we're more prone to blood sugar dips, which is gonna cause more of these PMS symptoms. So this is a perfect example as to how tracking your cycle can give you more insight into what's going on specifically with your hormones throughout your cycle, how to start to address your hormonal imbalances. This is exactly what I teach you inside my group program, The Hormone Healing Method, where we dive deeper into what's going on with your specific hormones, and I show you the roadmap on how to start to heal naturally. Hope this helps.